In this video, we will learn about what is atmospheric pressure, gauge pressure, absolute pressure and vacuum pressure and we will understand the relation between these types of pressure. The atmospheric pressure caused by the earth's atmosphere. That means atmospheric pressure is the force exerted by the air above the surface of earth as the gravity pulls it to the earth and it is also known as air pressure. A barometer is commonly used to measure atmospheric pressure. The atmospheric pressure at sea level is 1.013 bar. The gauge pressure is the pressure of system measured by the pressure gauge above atmospheric pressure. The gauge pressure is positive for the pressures above atmospheric pressure. And the gauge pressure is negative for the pressures below atmospheric pressure. The absolute pressure is the sum of gauge pressure and atmospheric pressure. The vacuum pressure is the measurement of pressure below the atmospheric pressure in which atmospheric pressure taken as reference. It is also known as negative gauge pressure or suction pressure. The instrument used to measure vacuum pressure is known as vacuum gauge. If a container is completely evacuated, then the pressure exerted on the surface is zero. Such zero pressure is called as absolute zero pressure or absolute vacuum pressure. Vapor pressure of a liquid solution is the amount of pressure that the vapors exerted on liquid solvent when they are in equilibrium and a certain temperature. The vapor pressure equal to force divided by area where force is measured in Newton and area is measured in meter square. Hence the unit of vapor pressure is Newton per meter square or Pascal. Vapor pressure changes with the temperature of surroundings and the nature of liquid. A liquid is more volatile if its vapor pressure is higher. For example, vapor pressure for petrol at 20 degrees Celsius is 30.4 kPa while that of water is 2.345 kPa. For this reason, petrol vaporizes faster than water. Now we will see the units of pressure. First is PSI that is pounds per square inch is the unit of measure of 1 pound of force applied to 1 square inch of area. Next is bar. 1 bar is equivalent to earth air pressure at sea level. The bar device has been developed in Europe and it is still widely used. Next is Pascal. 1 Pascal equal to 1 Newton of pressure per square meter. Next is in HG that is inches of mercury. It is the unit of pressure exerted by 1 inch circular column of mercury. Usually Barometric pressure is used in HG. Next is Tor. This is the pressure exerted by 1 mm high circular column of mercury. Next is in H2O that is inches of water. This is the unit of measurement for 1 inch circular column of water. It is typically used for differential pressure measurements or low pressure water applications.